So I think it's a it's a absolutely a fantastic opportunity for uh, for exchange. Obviously, the the research content that we do in the technical piece is all structured, and that's kind of expected. But what has been fantastic is the unexpected uh, interchange that happens outside of the the research work that we're doing. I'd say this especially. To learn about the situation in the higher education system much better in Spain. I mean. So I, I think it's uh, given me a better understanding about the direction of Spain and then how we can cooperate with the American education system. Absolutely enriching, uh, uh, immersive, uh, thick with opportunities. I can't believe we get to do this. Eye-opening and rewarding. I'd say the opportunity for scientific and cultural exchange is invaluable and the opportunity to travel with our families and engage them in that opportunity is just an unbelievable experience for all of us. There are experts in every single coastal community in Spain that I felt uh, interested in collaborating with. So I saw that as a, a great opportunity to come to Spain and establish new collaborations with them. Spaniard I've uh, had an interaction with here has been extremely eager to have those kinds of uh, interdisciplinary exchanges. So, uh, to do my research, and through that I've met friends, I've made connections um, that have led to professional connections. So I think just staying active, doing things that you're interested in. Um, Definitely. Um, one of the things that really struck me during orientation in September was that we were encouraged to serve as ambassadors through all of our everyday experiences and to remember that we are American ambassadors to Spain, whether we're in the grocery store, or talking with friends, or meeting new people in, in a random place. And whether it's TAs incorporating American um, culture to their curriculum or researchers interacting with their labs, every experience here in Spain um, is, is an opportunity to challenge a stereotype and to foster multiple. permanently outside of my comfort zone. This ain't the life that I ever dreamed of thought I'd be my king. Be my queen. Castle is gone. for me is hands down just been relationships with the actual students uh, you know that's teaching is fun uh, the actual material is fun but getting to know the kids is is definitely the most fun you know, there's there's one girl who well I just want to not reiterate but to add upon what what Danielle my colleague Danielle Alexander was talking about earlier um, I think that in terms of my most rewarding aspect about being in Spain or I mean about being able to teach here in Madrid is um, just being a, a part of people's lives, of my students' lives. My full experience has been amazing and um, it's going really fast but um, more than I had ever anticipated. I think some of the most important lessons that I'll be able to take back from my experience here is definitely gaining a new understanding and respect for, for education. Enriching, challenging, and a blast.
Yeah.